Welcome to the Dentamax Tip of the Week. Today, I wanted to talk to you guys about something that we get calls about quite often and how you can resolve it. When you post charges to a patient's ledger and you go to create the claim and you realize, oh no, I forgot to attach the insurance. This happens because the front office just wants to get the info in so that we can take the patient back, start taking x-rays, and then we start putting the rest of the information in as the patient's being seen, and sometimes things just get missed. So if that happens to you, to add the insurance to the patient after you've posted the charges, the first thing you want to do is go into the patient's information screen. So I'm gonna click Larry Hughes and hop there. Choose the insurance information tab and then simply fill in the blanks. So who's the subscriber, what's the insurance plan, and then any additional information it asks you for. Save your changes. And then from here, we want to go ahead and choose view billing options, fill current insurance, and then it's gonna ask us if we want the insurance for this billing to be changed to match the fee schedule associated with the contracted amounts. I'm going to say yes, because I always want to go ahead and match those rates. And do the items need to be billed to the new insurance? Yes, they do. Close the screen. You'll now notice under insurance one, it does give me their insurance information, how much is estimated to be paid by insurance, and the estimated head of household's responsibility. From here, we can go ahead and create our claim and send it off. I hope this tip of the week has been helpful. If you have additional questions, feel free to contact our training department, 1-800-704-8494 and dial one, then two for training, or, or email training at dentamax.com. And I hope to see you next week back here again.